Thank you for being here. My name is Nick Tanik. I'm an artist, public speaker, and the founder of Psychilic Thailand, aka Sai Thai. This is my second time here, and if you don't know, now you know. So, um, a part of being artist, Psychilic Thailand is a community that focusing on science, spiritual, plant medicine. We are community. We have workshop integration, but I'm not here to promoting my organization or boosting my ego. But just let you know what we did, and maybe we can have a room for collaborate, do something, co-create, right? And the poet that I will read tonight is a part of my show called Dharma Trip. So the Dharma Trip. Is the performance that inspired by the fourth noble truth of Buddhism, and it's a mix between trippy, psychedelics, and Buddhism. So this is the the third piece of the whole show, but let's check it out. If craving will last forever, I be down on my knee. I completely surrender. I allow suffering to break my heart. Until it start to open, like a cocoon dying from its old self, I can't reach to the heaven without embracing hell. I search inside my soul to find the key to the kingdom of God that hardly explain. No beginning. No ending, no day or night, no right or wrong, no loss or pain, no gain or sorrow. Out of ego, out of self, out of karma, out of reincarnation, the eternal place beyond space and time. In that place, I never born, so I never die. But how can we explain the land to the fish of the sea? Say there's another place that you could be, that you can talk, you can walk, and you're all free. What could it be? What could it be? What could it be? How does it feel to breathe above the water? Say there was a place to live without any pain and sorrow. In the present, not yesterday or tomorrow. What could it be? What could it be? What could it be? How can the blind see the beauty of the sunrise? Say there's a place beyond imagination of your mind, somewhere with the music, the relics, the beautiful sounds that you can hear. How can you explain it all to the fish without ears? I have the second one called "Who I Am." Who I am? If I'm not my name or my story, if I'm not my body or even my mind, 
who I am. I'm a winner. I'm a loser. I'm a saint. I'm a sinner. I'm a wind passed through the leaf of the sea. I'm the wave of the million of the sea. If I remember who I am, can you call me by my true name? Yes, I'm a children of the star, a particle of the stardust, earth, wind, and fire. I'm a son of Mother Earth and the Father Tam. I'm the melody of the universe, the samsara lullaby. Who I am? I'm not here. I'm not there. I see myself in everywhere. In the shadow of the moon, in the prize of the sun. I'm in you. You in me, and we are one. Take a look around. Take a look around. Take a look around. The temple. Is here, and the temple is now. The temple is inside of us, waiting to be found. The temple is everywhere, when we allow, when we forgive, when we let go. Brother, sister, let's walk each other home, and remind each other the truth. That there is no temple anywhere else. The real temple is inside you. Thank you. <laughs>